Okay, and then another verb that ends in AR is caminar. Okay, so it ends in AR. It means to walk. <clears throat> so I'm going to take this part in here. Camin. And I'm going to add ADL. ADL. Okay, so if a verb ends in AR, you're going to add ADO. Sorry, that's messy. ADO. There we go. There we go. Okay, and then if it ends in ER or IR, then you're going to add, you're going to do the same thing. You're going to add IDO. Okay, so comer to eat. The past participle, which means eaten, is com. I just take this part, com, and then I add IDO. Ido, comida. <clears throat> For vivir, I'm going to take this part, vive. And then add IDL, vivido. Okay, so that is how you do uh, the past participle. So the top is doing the helping verb, and the bottom is the past participle. So we're doing an example down here, okay, of doing a whole phrase. So if we want to say, I have lived in Kansas City, or no, we'll say, I have lived in Carrollton. You can write yo if you want. You don't have to in this case. I. And then if I'm in the helping verb, I have. A. Mm -hmm. And then the past participle of vivir is vivido. Vivido. Um, in, well, I'll just do Casey. Por tres años. Okay. So there's one example. Um, and then we'll do eaten. Something crazy I have eaten. Oh, I know. Um, I have eaten tongue, cow tongue, a few times. So, yo, I'm going to find I have, the helping verb, a, eaten is right here and it comes from to eat, comida. Lengua. Um, unas veces. Or varias veces. A couple times in my life. Okay, so I'm going to erase this. We're going to do some more examples right here. Um, okay, next one we're going to change it up just a little bit. Um, let's say we have, um, we have gone, we'll just keep, stick with these verbs right here. We have walked to school many times. So I'm not even going to write the nosotros because it's such a long word and I have a tiny space. So we have walked. So first I need the we have, which is hemos. And if you write nosotros and you want to write nosotros, it's fine. But I have very little space and I don't need to because this is the only word. Amos always in Spanish will mean we have as a helping verb. We have walked. The word, the verb for to walk is caminar. <clears throat> so I'm going to take the root of the word or the stem. It's camin. It's an AR verb. So I'm going to add the ending ADL. Amos cami. Nado. A la escuela. Ah, uh, what is it? Muchas veces. Yeah. All right. Okay, our next one. Let's do you, like I'm talking to you, my students. You have lived in Carrollton for many years. Us or to us. Vivido. Okay, because to live in Carrollton. For muchos años.
Okay, you have 